Hey everyone, it's Bob Monsell, the Security Marketing Guru, and uh, today I want to go over uh, security marketing sales prevention. Are you stopping yourself from making more sales, you as a security dealer, the owner of the company, or your sales rep? And I just want to think about a couple of things, have you think about a couple of things, is that like, you know, is that person, that, that car sales rep, who you bought your last service vehicle from or your your vehicle for your own personal use, have they called you? Have they bothered to send you a written note to say like, hey, Jim, do you guys need any service vehicles now for your fleet? Is there is it time for you to upgrade your uh, your Tahoe? You know, is this going on? And um, why I say that is that a lot of people are saying that, you know, there's a bad economy out there, but I would say it's more than likely it's bad selling and it's bad marketing. And I'm going to go into this in this little uh, video that we're shooting right now. And, you know, we can talk about, you know, the banks not lending uh, money to businesses, but what about the people that are in charge of sales and marketing for security business? They're cutting back on the marketing of their company. They're not doing it. And now is the best time to be in the mode of acquiring clients for your business. There's been no better time than ever because people are cutting back on uh, on spending money, excuse me, on spending money, on doing direct mail of the company. So now it's, it's a prime time to be out there marketing to, to new biz businesses and the new niches and stuff. And here's a, an interesting example is, you know, at my home, we are in need of a roof for our house. You know, roof is right up there and it's probably a fifteen to a twenty thousand dollar job just to put on this new roof. And my wife Natasha, you know, she's calling around to get some pricing from roofers to have them come here and get some estimates. You know, so far she's called six roofers. If I don't get stung doing this, but uh <laughs> it's a big bumblebee. But she's called six roofers and out of the six of them, only three of them have called her back. Um, and of the three people that have physically called back, they have only two of the roofers have bothered to show up and give us a, a quote to do our roof. And the two guys that have showed up um, and have given my wife Natasha a quote, how many of them have actually called back to say, hey, what's going on? You know. Are you looking at something else? You know, could we go with a different material? Uh, you know, is there something else I could do for you? They haven't been engaging in the sales process. And I bet you if you ask these guys, you know, they're slow, the economy stinks. But what they don't understand is that I'm a buyer, that I've actually raised my hand and said, like, you know, I'm in need of a roof. They know that I'm in need of a roof. Uh, but they haven't been able, there's been no follow-up after the fact. And that's why a lot of companies, a lot of security dealers, low voltage installers, electricians, plumbers, that's why they're sucking wind right now is because, you know, they're not following up after the fact. And, you know, I've identified myself as a buyer, but still they haven't taken it to the next level. And a couple of other things is that, like, I want you to think about is that, you know, sure, people have been cutting back, uh, you know, on buying some things. But they're being more selective. Uh, they might not be buying the, the priciest thing out there, but they're still buying. And buying and selling are still occurring in this economy. Don't kid yourself. And what's required, what's required for this economy is better marketing, uh, a better marketing system for your security business, uh, better salesmanship. Uh, a couple of things is that like your your cost to acquire a client could be greater, but then again, it's the lifetime value of being able to get this new client in the door and then maximize the return on this individual over the lifetime of your business. But make no mistake, make no mistake at all, that buying and selling is occurring in this economy. And there's a great quote I want to leave you with. Um, the gentleman's name is. W. Clement Stone is probably one of the best quotes ever. And write this one down. Um, this is what I call a writer downer. 
and W. Clement Stone uh, said this, and he was he had an insurance business uh, back in the 30s during the Depression, and he built, I believe it was a billion dollar company uh, that he built for uh, salespeople, and he had a, a selling system for insurance people. It was incredible. And what he said, the sale is contingent upon the attitude and the actions of the salesperson and not the buyer. Let me say this one more time. The sale is contingent upon the attitude and the actions of the salesperson and not the buyer. Thanks for joining me on uh, the Security Marketing Sales Prevention Department video. And uh, now go smoke your competition and have a great one. And uh, we'll be talking to you soon. Thanks again. It's Bob Monsell, the Security Marketing Guru. And I made it through this video <laughs> without getting stung. Uh, have a good one, and we'll, uh, we'll talk to you soon. Thanks. Peace. Go rock and roll.